everybody and welcome to another Chelsea Cream World episode. This is episode number 26 in our series and we're getting down to the, like, almost to the end of the Premier League season, almost the end of the first season. And in today's episode, we've got two games. We've got a big game against Swansea that was two days after our game against Norwich City. And then we were back in the Champions League for the second leg against Borussia Mönchengladbach. So let's go look at the table and see what we're at. Alright guys, so here's the table. We are looking pretty on top here by 5 points over Tottenham Hotspur, uh, who we actually do play in, I believe it won't be the next episode, but it'll be the episode after that we play Spurs in the league, so that'll be a big game for us. And then we play Manchester City, and then we have Leicester to end the season. We have a few more games. I believe we play Bournemouth to get in there somewhere. Anyway, so guys, let's jump into our first game against Swansea. Alright, so here's the squad we're going with against Swansea here. It's, it's a pretty weak side. I believe it's pretty much the same side we played against Norwich just a few days ago, but with the Champions League game coming up, I do not want to risk uh, losing any of my big players. So let's jump in this game against Swansea and hopefully get a win. Atta, who getting the start here, and now Falcao can drive at the Swansea defense here. And he's going to play Kennedy. Kennedy, the shot, the rebound. Good block by the Swansea defense, and Falcao just wasn't quite fast enough there to... To beat the defenders, but this time he's gonna get the shot here. Falcao with the finesse shot and a good save from Fabianski and a good start to this game for us. We're all over Swansea. For him. Great ball wide here for Kennedy. Kennedy's gonna cut inside. Kennedy cutting by two, three, the shot, and it's just over the bar. He's gotta do better with that. And uh, the score remains nil-nil. Here we go on the attack, and that ref's gonna blow half time here. The score at the Liberty Stadium at halftime is nil-nil. Not too many chances. I believe we should be winning this game, though we've had a few chances that we should have put away. But I feel pretty confident for the second half that we can get two or three. So let's get in the second half and let's go. Back there to make that block. It was a good opportunity for us to get forward. Swansea breaking forward here. It's quite a bit of pace. And uh, they're going to... Great ball from them. It's a great shot. It's 1-0 Swansea. And out of nowhere... Swansea have taken the lead here, and that's, I don't even know how many goals, I don't think we've conceded that many goals, but Pelosi with an absolute thunderbolt, top corner past Courtois, I'd like to see the replay, because I was quite a bit of ways out here, I don't know how he actually managed to put that one top corner, but a great play from Swansea, and a first time hit, I think Courtois should be doing a little bit better with that, to be completely honest, it was right almost down the middle of the goal, but he put a really interesting curve on it, but I don't think that should be going by Courtois. And uh, it's 1-0 Swansea, so now we got to get back in this game. And is currently Jeopardy here. Uh, so here we go. Bertrand Traore is going to cut in first time here. He's going to cut down. Bertrand Traore cleaned out in the penalty area, and that's an instant reply. Hopefully we can get the goal, though, from it. From Bertrand Traore, he did really well. Falcao, he's not scored a penalty for a little while. He's going to take the penalty, and Fabianski has somehow saved that. Oh, Falcao cannot score for me in this series. He has not scored, he's had two or maybe even three penalties, and that was our chance to at least make sure we were back in this game, and we've thrown it away here, and now it's going to be game on. Loftus-Cheek's going to be able to turn the shot from Loftus-Cheek, and a great save again from Fabianski, who's on steroids. To really be honest, uh, I mean, Swansea are a pretty good side, so let's see if we can get this ball. Kennedy driving by one, two, plays the ball dangerously across, no one is there. What a great ball from Kennedy, though. Kennedy's got the ball, though, in a dangerous area. And he's going to try and cut by here. Cut by two. The shot from Kennedy. The goal from Kennedy. And it's 1-1 Chelsea. That is what I'm talking about, guys. 1-1 Chelsea. And Swansea, that is a huge goal. And Kennedy, our hero here. He's come out of nowhere with a great bit of skill from a pretty scrappy defensive play from Swansea. And it is 1-1 Chelsea. That is what I'm talking about. Great little running here in behind. I like that. I like that a lot, because now Pato can cut inside dangerously. The sh... Talked about that. Now Loftus-Cheek has been outdone here by Gomez. Or not really by Gomez, more by the ball. But he's going to get the ball in. Pelosi. Dangerous from Pelosi. It's 2-1 Swansea. Oh, Pelosi. Everything he touches turns to gold. And it's Leroy for the former QPR player. Makes it 2-1 Swansea. And all of a sudden, our undefeated season is at jeopardy again. Oh, they're going to just take it... Their corner flight. Great tackle. Back into the middle, and that is going to be full time. And I am so gutted with that. That is our first loss of the season. It comes 33 games into the season. We were five games away from an undefeated season here. And Swansea have spoiled that. And I, I am so upset right now about that. That really sucks. Anyways, though, guys, we have a game against uh, yeah, Borussia Mönchengladbach. Let's get into that game, and it's at the bridge, so we have the home advantage. Let's go on, and let's let's make up for the... Alright, everybody, so welcome back to this episode. We got the game against Mönchengladbach in the Champions League here. 
at home. And I'm going with a pretty strong side. Maybe it's a bit of overkill, but we are only up 2-0 on aggregate. And I'm hoping to keep it that way. Let's get in this game and hopefully win. Now they're going to probably score from this, aren't they? Yeah, they're going to because they're going to get a sweaty cross in here. Yeah. I, oh my goodness gracious. If I had conceded there, I would have absolutely lost it because I was I didn't even make that pass. They just they love this game loves to do that where you don't actually make a pass, but they make it anyway. I really I really am scared right now this moment. They're outplaying us by a lot. And normally I get outplayed in the second half. So hopefully that they're since they outplayed me in the first half, we're gonna be better in the second half. So I'm gonna make a few changes and let's jump into the second half. I'm making a double substitution. I'm bringing on Diego Costa and Oscar for Dybala and Cesc Fabregas. A little bit more of a physical presence in Diego Costa and Oscar over Fabregas and Dybala. So hopefully those guys are going to get us a little bit going forward. And let's get in the second half and hopefully win. The ball over to Eden Hazard. Eden Hazard is going to make the turn. Eden Hazard into the penalty area. Eden Hazard the shot. And it's 1-0 Chelsea. And that should be game set and match. What a goal from Eden Hazard. And man, he's magic. That's really our first chance of the game. I mean, Mucha Gladbach have been the better team, no doubt about it. But with that, that goal should, that should be the final blow. That should be able to knock the socks off of them. And we should be going on to the next round of the Champions League. What a goal. Eden Hazard just cuts inside and smashes it in. Let's go, Chelsea. Eden Hazard's going to just... Take it around his man here. He's going to drive him wide. Cutting into the middle. Cleaned out. And there's a penalty. And uh, we don't have Falcao on the pitch to mess it up. So hopefully Eden Hazard, who does have a few penalty goals, can get another one here. Going to go same way. There we go. 2-0 Chelsea. Hazard with both of the goals. He's just ripping it up here in the second half. In a great second half it is. It's 2-0 Chelsea. Come on. And that is going to be full time, guys. The final score is 2 0 Chelsea. We are going on to the final four of the Champions League. And that is going to end this episode. Let's go have a look at the league table. All right, guys. So after 33 games in the Premier League, we are sitting top of the league by only two points over Spurs. We dropped two. We dropped three valuable points today, and that, that is our first loss. It's pretty devastating. There's a number one there under our L column. Uh, still, only one loss is pretty darn good, but it's not really good enough. Uh, it's, I'm pretty sad about it, but anyways, so guys, let's go have a look at our at the calendar. All right, guys, so here's the Champions League bracket. As you guys can see, Valencia actually managed to beat Barcelona out here, so we're gonna actually be playing Valencia in the next round of the Champions League, which I just absolutely am stoked with because it's way better than playing Barcelona. And Bayern Munich are gonna be facing off against Arsenal. All right, guys, so to end this episode, we're gonna just look at the calendar here, and this is this is the games that we have. So we got. We got Everton. We've got a week off uh, after the Everton game before our Champions League first leg uh, against Valencia. I'm not sure if that's home or away. It doesn't really say. But uh, anyways, then we got a day break. Then we got Manchester City. And then another day break. And then a big, big game against Tottenham Hotspur. So I'm going to probably have to field a really horrible team against Manchester City. Because the game against Spurs is going to be a champion, a championship six-pointer. And then uh, to end the season, we've got another Valencia game, and we've got three more Premier League games in the next month here. So anyways, I'll hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, remember to leave a like down below, and uh, subscribe if you're new. And until next time, guys, take care.